looking to see some funny stuff. Whenever, whenever Ice is on stream, I want to see some funny stuff happen. So Mason's a long time ISIS player as well, by the way. Like, hella old long school. time. Yeah. Alright, here we go for game one. He used to be uh, top of SA like when you start. Yeah, basically way back in the day, hey. It's cool to see he's back. I mean, I never knew him as an old school player. He joined, I think he came back before I did. So. The twins are still alive. Oh, okay. None is gone. Mason looking to get as much percent as possible. Oh, not a lot. Okay. One grab. Oh. Oh, the blizzard. Okay, nice shit to Mason, taking game one. I just gotta say, I love this venue. I think this is such a great venue. The big cheese is in. We've got the ultimate players, like, they can stay on that fucking side. We're over here. Alright, who won that first game? Sorry, folks. Mason. Nice, thank you. Alright. I think we're all good now. I had to fix up a few things left over from doubles. Alright, well done to Mason, though. So, I'm pretty sure... If I'm not mistaken, yeah, we all best of five in bracket today. Yeah, nice. That is the plan, so there is no ban. And Luma sticking Fox. Well, I really would say that it's probably the best choice in this situation. I would agree, yeah. Alright, yeah, folks, let us know if the audio is alright, if we need to turn the game or the, um, the mics up or down. I think I'm, the game's quite loud, though, but I'm just adjusting that now. One interesting thing about uh, swapping characters when you're playing against ICs is like, obviously Mason knows the weights of every character and how to do handoffs with them, but when it comes to actually like performing on stage, you know what I mean? Oh, here we Ooh. go. Yeah, no, N Mason actually has um, good execution for this character, which is like 
I don't know. I don't think this character is like easy by any like stretch of measure, right? Like, no, no. Genuinely speaking, like, uh, I remember speaking with Mason personally, like, not too long ago, about how recently what happened was Mason had like a bit of a break because you know he was having a bit of trouble with just like kind of staying in it, right? After being like so in it for so long, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, but when he came back, he decided to actually research and like look up what like all the Nana AI behavior traits there are, right? And instead of just being like upset that like she's doing stuff that she doesn't want him to, he actually went and like, you know, kind of worked ways around it so that he can actually play these partners better, right? And like you're seeing it right now, he's like sort of in control of this matchup. Mason does not blame Nana for a lot of stuff. No, he, he blames other than like just SD, like when she does just SD from like air dodging or whatever. But like even he knows like sometimes Nana SDing is his fault. Yeah, exactly. Now, like he, that's why like I'm, I really do respect like the effort that he's put into like get better at this character because you don't see ICs that often. There aren't many. Now we got Cookbook in New Zealand, who I think is probably the most equivalent like skill level to Mason in ICs. But then, other than that, it's like Yellow is a BB player, or just graduated. They play Congrats. ICs. Yeah. Um, so up and comers, but it's definitely a funky character. There's also not a lot of ICs representation at like top level either. So Mason's got a lot of ideas about like the way to play neutral with ICs and how far you can take the matchup that you know top players just aren't playing because there just isn't that representation. Like Slugs, you know, retired. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, just the F smash. <laughs> That'll happen. All right, two O so far. Mason looking pretty in control. Mason but I think good, yeah. what was good there was Luma was actually pick, like picking stuff up and like you know putting things together on Yoshi's. I think like going back to Yoshi's wouldn't be too bad. However, we are looking at going to game three on Stadium though. Unless she surprises us last second. Well, we'll see. I don't know what's going to happen here, actually. Yep. Okay, yeah. Is Stadium Tip will be good against Icings for uh, spacing? Well... <laughs> uh, I don't know. As a Martha, I always want to stick to the try. Like, you know. Ooh, it, the... It, five has ice there. Here we go. Still going. And that's the start. Oh, fuck. What a nice grab from Mason there. Starting with the blizzard in the firebox, which is sick. Something I only learned today about blizzard was uh, you actually, the chance to get frozen is like a random probability that starts at some percent for each unique character. Like, I actually unique. didn't it's know like, that. It's what? like weight dependent. What? Yeah. No. When you'll like start having a chance to get frozen. Okay, so, that's nuts. It's fucking weird. Now it's got a bunch of that like ran random like randomness in it. You know what I mean? Like mm. Peach dropping turnip. So just like oh, it's a random percent. Oh, the jab reset. The Sopo is going crazy right now. Oh, okay, it's still Sopo against Fox. Double bear. Uh, I actually hate it when that happens. You think you have like sort of an advantage after doing a throw versus ICs, and then nope, you no, don't. You do not. This is always one of them. And Mason's so good at like when he's the one getting thrown, he still knows how to like control Nana to take advantage of it. It's fucked. Yeah, like if you're if you're actually like the one kind of throwing ICs, you have to be careful because like the goal for you is actually to use the throw miss ability in a way that like 
you're, you're actually sort of charging through like an ASCI down situation, but it's hard to do that in the right time. But it's looking like Mason's going to clean this one up pretty handily. But Luma makes it back for one last shot. That up smash oh, is still not doing not gonna it. Kill. That was, I just picked up air. It's so funny when Isis get like hits that center the top because they can't follow up. Oh, nice. Well that's done to Mason. Right. Yeah, let's go, Mason. There you go. Well done. All right. So we have another game marked as well. Uh, I believe we have Monke and Nangs. Oh, let's go. So that's a 3 0 to Mason, who will be going on to fight Goody in the next round. Ooh. So look forward to that one. Um, let's get them over. Yeah, yeah you're up. All right. Let's get it. Uh, I'm going to quickly adjust the camera brightness. It's, yep. still too, it's still too bright. <laughs> one sec. Hold it down. 